this pumpkin is turning pink. Good afternoon, YouTube family. We are off to do a little shopping at Whole Foods. Martin is having his private with Coach Noah. And I have no idea how he's doing. We'll see. It should be really cool because it's his first like more private lessons in soccer that he started. So I'm curious to see how he did, what he learned. Yeah, let's get on with those dolls, shall we? And how was your first private? Good. What did you do there? Like a lot of dribbling skills, and it was really hard work. Did you do like did no, we you do didn't any do games? Any, no, we didn't do any games. We just worked on skills and everything. Was there other people there, or only him? No, but that's better than games skills. So he's working most of the skills. He always works. On and at the end, we play a fun game. What did you play? Shooting. Hmm. I mean, scoring. Okay. How many people were there? Not, not a lot, like seven. Including you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So he goes to these private trainings, but it's not one on one, it's like a small group of seven. I think it's worth the money because it's, it's like five. really hard work. I'm sweating. Sometimes yeah. Sometimes it's six people. Very cool. Very, very cool. Right now we're deciding to go to Dollar Tree or Five Below. I'm not deciding. I'm going to Five trainings. Below. I'm gonna go to Dollar Tree. Uh, if, if three people well, out of four, guys, go okay, to well, I did, we didn't. Guys, but don't you want to go to Dollar Tree? Because that way you get. Wait, Martin. That way you get more things because everything is a dollar there. Yeah, but we've been in Dollar Tree. It's not like that interesting. Time. Yeah, and there's not this much is, that you can get from like four or one. Well, then I won't buy anything and wait till next. When we do school next. thing, you'll just buy your supplies and all that stuff. Like, why would you go now? Good morning, YouTube family. We are off to gymnastics. 
We're taking the elevator. Mariana is going by the stairs. Martin and Milana are um, doing soccer early in the morning. Milana says she wants to be a soccer player, so she's off with her brother doing soccer. We'll see. Maybe that's what it'll be. Two kids in gymnastics, two kids in soccer. You never know. Mike, can you press one, please? Oh, I pressed three, and I thought we were... Here we go. Let this beautiful day begin. I hope you have a wonderful day, and enjoy us. Subscribe if you haven't. It's Family Day Life, and we do family videos, vlogging, and a lot of the times useful information for kids and the family. I'm going out my mind Give me some directions to get to you to get to you ain't gonna waste my time i know that we got connection i think about you you're on my mind on my mind on my mind yeah i'm going out of my mind of my finally gonna have some breakfast you just seen what that looks like i'm having some peas some salad and some watermelon I think I'm doing a little bit of a detox. Um, just always comes a time in summer where I feel like more detoxing food. Mmm. Salad tastes amazing. One of my favorite salads. Summer salad, I call it. Tomatoes, cucumbers, and avocado. Mm. I love peace by itself. So sweet, you guys. So good. I don't even think it's breakfast time anymore. It's more like lunch time. It's around 12. I haven't eaten anything since last night at 6. I try to eat by 6 when I'm at home, doesn't count for when we go out, but when I'm at home I try to make my meal at 6. I do this because I feel comfortable when I'm going to sleep on an empty stomach. When I eat and go to sleep I feel very uncomfortable, so I do this for that sole purpose. But in the morning when I drink the celery juice I am not as hungry for some really weird reason. Drinking celery juice on an, empty, on an empty stomach pushes my hunger away until about 10, 30, 11. And then by the time I prepare something to eat or answer some client calls, I'm already busy. So I pretty much start my days with lunch rather than breakfast. But you know, in Florida right now it's really hot. And I feel like when you're in the heat all the time, you don't want to eat as much. I'm just not as hungry. So. Actually, if you feel really, really hungry in Florida, and then you go outside, you know that hunger just goes away. It's a funny trick. <laughs> because in heat, you don't really want to eat, you want to drink, so. I know the couple of times when I was like, you know one of those days when you eat a lot? I was eating and eating and eating and I'm like, okay, this has got to stop. Just have those days when I'm just constantly hungry. I don't know why. So I remember I was like so hungry and then I'm like, what do I do? I'm still so hungry. But I know I'm not hungry, meaning like I ate. You can go outside, instantly you're like, all I want is drink some ice water <laughs> because it's so hot. So it's like a good trick to do if you live in the heat country or like in a sunny country. Okay guys, I'm going to eat this delicious salad and then I'm going to do some work. You guys, Milana brought me my lunch. She made it all by herself. Hold on.
There it is. Just basically put these like the peas on the toothpicks. This is my lunch. Thank you. <laughs> and she bought me salad. <laughs> More salad. <laughs> you are so cute, Bella. <laughs> are you gonna eat the peas too? No, don't. Are, are you? You eat it too, it's good. Mmm. Mm. Healthy greens. I'm gonna get some more peanuts. Okay. She's gonna get some more peanuts. She's been calling these peas a peanuts. I don't know why. Look at this. <laughs> How adorable is this? Came to Martin's soccer. Ooh, I see him. Finally home, you guys. It's been such a long day. The kids are cleaning in the kitchen. They were screaming in the car, their lungs out. So I told them that because they were misbehaving, they owe me a chore. <laughs> All the problems are solved with chores. But anyways, Mariana is cleaning the dishwasher. Milana is setting up the table for dinner. I think it's almost eight o'clock. Martin is on the way home and I'm just super tired. I have a headache, so I'm just super, super, super tired. Just wanna take a shower and go to sleep. My dinner was boba tea. <laughs> okay guys, thanks for watching. I love you. I'll see you tomorrow. This pumpkin is turning pink. Stay tuned for more after photos. <laughs> We are getting some pink hair! Ness, do you like it? There we are! Pink little princess. Guys, we got this at like dollar store. It was like a dollar <laughs> and it's just so cute. It's gonna wash off with like a couple of washes, but I feel like it's such a good experience for any girl that likes pink. I'm and it smells so good. It's got like this really cool furry smell. So, Melanie's all pink, my little pink princess. <laughs>
Guys, we are off to picking up Maya. She had a private for ballet. Girls training hard. <laughs> Mr. Martin here is going to train for futsal. It's his last practice. And then after practice, we're gonna go for dinner. Just to recoup and celebrate the end of the camps and get ready for school. School is in when? Two weeks? Yeah. School is soon. Y'all know what I'm gonna do. First day of school, I'm having that champagne. <laughs> Because this is the first year I'm going to have four students in school. Four. So it's going to be nice. Okay, guys. Jokes, be happy. jokes aside, I am excited for school. Excited for them. And you're alone. Excited to see what four students in school will feel like. I'm sure it's going to be chaotic as always. But hey, look at the bright side. You are always a part of it. We'll see you shortly. Guys, we are going to have dinner at our favorite Outback Steakhouse. <gasps> I think we've come and here mom, like twice a week. And mom, did you know that the baby mom had green hair too? Yeah. Yeah, but she didn't have it. We saw some lady with green hair today. Good morning, YouTube family. Now the beautiful sunny morning. We are going to gymnastics. This time, three kids in gymnastics. Milana is going as well with the other two, so... I guess that's where we're at. With the three girls in gymnastics. And one boy in soccer. Guys, we are at the opening of Sandal Academy for our friends. She opened an academy. Beautiful daycare. Martin just finished soccer practice and joining us at a party. And hungry. Free food. <laughs> Good morning, YouTube family. We are still waking up from the party last night. We got home. At what time did we get home? 
11. Get home at 11 with the kids. Max was already sleeping in bed and it was just such a crazy night, but it was so, so good. Well, I stayed till 11.11. Maya stayed till 11.11 because she had to make a wish. It was just such a beautiful event and beautiful day in a sense that there were so many people that were just full of love and good vibes and absolutely love that event. Just a beautiful daycare that will be just thriving because of the people that are behind it and because of how gorgeous it is and just wishing them the absolute best in the Sandville Academy. But we know that they'll do great because they're just amazing people with amazing hearts. We are off to Starbucks. And then to get Mimaya and Mariana. Max took Milana and Martin and took off already. Two Starbucks. We're gonna have some coffee and then we're gonna go to the doctors, you guys. Maya needs to get her immunization done for the school. Wait, is it a flu shot? No, it's not a flu shot. Because flu shot is against flu. This oh. is immunization. Oh. So, so she needs to get that done for oh. the school. Oh. Guys, did you see the eyelashes in my car? Did I even show them? I can't remember if I showed you or not, but I put some eyelashes in my car. She's a girl now. Hold on, I'll show you. Look at that. Nice. There's my girl. Look, a spider on it. Oh, that's okay. A little spider. That's the one There she is. Okay, let's go get that cold it? latte. I really need some latte after all those champagne drinks uh, yesterday. <laughs> but no, it's just so good. Um, yeah, and then we're off to do immunization. And then I think I have to do shopping, so stay tuned for our Saturday. Last time I took the chocolate, it was too sweet. But now it tastes so good. I got some brown sugar oat and it's got a lot of cinnamon. I like it, but Max hates it. Mom, can I try yours? I got dragon fruit with coconut milk. And it's really good. Coach Terrier told me that it's really good, so I tried it. It's really good. <laughs> Mariana has some strawberry acai and Martin there has a caramel crunch. Princess. She wants to buy these and I'm like, no. Oh, there they are. There's the vinyl erasers on the top. You guys, we are shopping for school for like two hours. There's so many things here. I have four lists, you guys. Four lists to fulfill. This is going to be a mission and a half. I need blue. This is Maya's list. Oh we are going through it. I don't know why the camera doesn't pick it up. So Here, hold and this. I have three, four, two more. Mom. No, three more. Maya has four lists on her own, and I've got um, somehow I can't. Oh, there we three go. Three lists. And I've got three lists. I've got so the second grade, lists. fourth, and kindergarten. I'm just going crazy with all these lists. So we have seven lists. Like, some of these are huge. Look at this, guys. Like, look at this. Mine is crazy. a whole page long. Like, we have like eight lists between me and Maya that we have to get, and it's like crazy. Why do I need 12 glue sticks? I don't know. For some reason, on Mariana's, they have like 12 glue sticks, sanitizers, tissue paper, wait, just a whole I, bunch of things. Wait, I need sanitizer? Yeah. And I'm looking for vinyl erasers they specifically want us to get vinyl erasers because they erase better you guys so it's been just mission and a half finding everything <sighs> two more hours and we should be done don't forget what you said we have to get some boba tea today you said that also i need black wiper markers i need the 
Shopping is never gonna get me tired. Clothing and stuff, I will. Food, I always. Well, if I'm not staying home, then you're not staying home. And I'm also tired of shopping. I mean, I'm super than... tired, but I don't want to make the shopping till tomorrow. I just don't. Really want to get the shopping done today and just like relax. So we'll see. But it's been one heck of a tiring shopping. And I don't understand. Milana need 24 glue sticks for one year. That's what I don't understand. On her list, we have 24 and glue sticks. Need, and why do I need 12 glue sticks? Well, 12 for you somewhat makes sense, but 24 glue sticks, you guys. No, she said 25. And 60 pencils. No, it's 24. Well, and, 60 pen needs, and 60 pencils. Milana needs 60 pencils. Yeah. Maybe because they use them up a lot, I don't know. Sometimes I feel like they just like they're gonna keep them get for extra. next. <laughs> yeah. Because like, can you imagine if there's like 30 students and everybody brings 60 pencils? 60 times 30 is 1,800 pencils. That's just crazy. But hey, we never know. Maybe they actually do end up using so many, so we never know. I know. Okay, Mine is, is for me. For me, also, I have like, I have like the br best but worst. Worst because I have four classes plus two online. Best because I only need one glue stick and like two pencils for the year. Like <laughs> middle school, but I do need a lot of other things like binders and index cards and calculators. And Maya does exist. She's just talking and somehow decides to film me while talking. Which yeah. Is interesting. I think she's still learning the camera work. Because you can Mariana's talk and see yourself. Mariana's down there. We bought like this cabinet and she's right behind it. She's holding it. Right, Mariana? She bought this thing. We bought a cabinet for their clothes and we couldn't fit it in other than putting it on Mariana's lap, but it's not heavy, so don't worry. <laughs> it's just not comfortable, but we had no other way. And it was such a beautiful deal. It was like 40 bucks for the whole cabinet and it's a beautiful cabinet for like some of their clothes, but we'll show I you want it. to install it. Look what I did. I want the water bottle to put some tape that you want. You guys, the bread is incredible. And the bubble tea. 